hand. Hey, what's up, you guys? So welcome back to my channel. Uh, I don't even know. I'm so excited today. I finally received a box that I've been waiting for literally like, let's see, I ordered it in March. No, I ordered it in April. So all of April, May, June, and July, four months. It's finally here and I'm so excited. Dun, 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 dun. The Wizarding Box. Yay. This is kind of like a subscription. This is from Loot Crate. And I, of course, got the J.K. Rowling's Wizarding World uh, subscription box. Um, this is delivered, I think, every, like, like not every other month but like like there's like one every three months or so that's kind of like what I understood this is the first box I ever get um I'll be putting all the details in the description box below just in case you want to subscribe uh but I'm so excited I have not opened it it has of course my address but it has the seal right there so that we can open it together and let's hope that this was good because I feel like I paid kind of like a lot uh, so we'll see what it has inside and hopefully it's worth it. So let's open. Oh, that's so cute. So the sticker that closes a box together says Expecto Patronum and it's of course, uh, what's it in English? Un alce? Uh, but it's the, the, it's Harry Potter's Patronus, his dad's Patronus to an elk, I think it is in English. Um, but anyways, let's open it. I'm excited. I'm kind of nervous. I've been waiting to do this video for so long. Like, well, I've been waiting to get the box for so long. Um, let's open it. Uh, let's see what's inside. First of all, what I see right there, there's a shirt. I say yes, because the shirt is always worth it. Let's hope it fits though. Um, that is so cute. So this my phone just decides to get notifications. So this box is super cute. It has like a little forest theme. Let's see the shirt. Oh, by the way, the way this box works is that every box has a different theme. At least that's what I understood. And the one I got supposedly is a dark arts theme. So everything is going to be geared towards that. So just so that you know, so that of course I won't be getting an exact like you know, Gryffindor everything or Ravenclaw everything. However, you are able to choose your house and just get, and if you do get house theme stuff, uh, you will get it for that house. Uh, in Potter, Pottermore, um, I'm a Ravenclaw, but of course at heart, I'm a Gryffindor. So I try to get stuff for both, but I really don't. I mostly just get Gryffindor, so. Okay, so let's see the shirt. Okay, I'm gonna put the box over there because I'm gonna open it up. Okay, here we go. So y'all are gonna see the shirt before I do. I'm so jelly. That's cute. That looks kind of big, but maybe not. So it says counter curse. Uh, dark art for limited time only and then I think that says free I don't know what that's on top I guess it's just like a little thing but that's kind of cute is it like I mean I guess I like it because it's Harry Potter was I expecting something like this not really I was kind of hoping to get something with Bellatrix face on it because I mean be Bellatrix is a cool villain. Like, I hate her, of course, for killing Sirius, but, like, she's she's funny. She's, like, funny. Like, I mean, in the, in the movies, like, Helena Bonham Carter really did her good. Like, she is such a funny lady. I can't. So, I do like the colors, though. I love the colors. I, lo I love how it's blue, and this is, like, a more sky blue. So, I'm gonna, you know, wear it later on, and it's actually licensed. I, I didn't think they would be licensed products, but apparently they are. So, that's cool. I'm excited. Also, my mom kind of always complains that I'm always wearing Harry Potter shirt so maybe this will throw her off and she won't know that unless she watches watches this video unless she watches this video but um anyways like it's cool I mean only I will know and of course Harry Potter fans will know that this is for Harry Potter so that's cool I'll be able to spot actual Harry Potter uh, fans here in my small town because I feel like nobody is as such a fan as me but we'll see okay let's see what's next Okay, stop. Oh my god. 
Oh my god, so I see that is so cute. So I have here a one pen. That is so cute. I saw the name. I was going to go for something there that looks super cute like leather that I don't know yet what it is. But then I saw the name Ollivanders and of course I had to open it. Okay, here we go. The packaging is the nicest. Like just, of course, I'm going to use a pen but to keep it, you know, as a, like a memory. And this is Severus Snape's. Severus Snape's want. <laughs> uh, I don't even know how many apostrophes are supposed to be there. Are supposed to be there? I guess just one, but there's too many asses. Anyways, that is totes cute. This is totally cute, guys. This presentation, I'm dying. Okay, let me see if I can take it out because with my nails, I can't do anything. I'm so tired. Ooh, I'm so. Ooh, it's actually quite heavy. I thought it was gonna be just like a regular pen. Ooh. This is nice. So the pen is like the handle thing. Well, not really the handle, but like the wand thing. And the cap of it is the wand. So Petrificus Totalis. This is totally cute. I don't know. Honestly, I don't know what all of the brand, oh, I mean, all of the wands look like. So I'm so excited that this one is pretty because some of them, I think it's Harry Potter's that's just like a wiggly thing all around. However, Hermione sells flowers, so I think that one's kind of cute. So I like that this one has super cute detail and it's actually like a pretty heavy pen. So I'm going to look pretty legit. I'm kind of scared since it's a sleeve that it's going to like fall off. Oh, kind of does. Does it click? Not really. But... It, I'm just going to be really careful. But I'm so excited because it's totally cute. I'm going to put it back before I break it. Hopefully not. Um, and let's open something else up. Okay, I'm totally going to open this leather thing next. Um, this says... Ooh, it's a journal. This is cute. And I don't even have to get my scissors. Okay, let's open it up. Um, I don't know how... I hope... I'm really hoping that it'll be... Uh, ruled not like uh, you know like the the diary Tom Riddle's diary that is just like paint, plain blank so I hope I hope that this is ruled let's see um, so it's has DA Dumbledore's army um, symbol thing here I'm gonna I'm just gonna tear it up I'm guessing because Dumbledore's army fought against the Death Eaters and that's why it's included in the dark arts but it's super cute the it feels like if it was leather or something it's pretty soft I'm pretty sure it's not leather because that that'll be really sad uh, but let's see let's hope it's ruled it is yay okay I'm so all oh, stop oh my god it has all of the names of the people that joined uh, well the Howard students that joined Dumbledore's army when Harry Potter was giving those lessons and all that um, so that is super cute you have like everybody's signatures that is cute let me see Ooh, this one is cute that one is also also Zachariah Smith that's actually a pretty legit one too so I'm excited. I don't know yet what I will be putting here. You know what? It would be super cute. Ooh, it has a little divider thing. It would be super cute if like in here I wrote like my grocery list and then I go to like ATB and I'm like, oh, let me see what's for lunch. Well, actually, let me see what I'm missing for lunch <laughs> or something like that. It look really super cute and it's going to fit right in my purse. So far, I'm really loving this box. The next item in here. Ooh. What is this? Let me do this. Um, it just says Harry Potter. Oh, okay, thank God. This is a Ziploc bag. Because I'm having such a hard time. But this looks like earrings or something. Let's see. Come on. I, all this wrapping paper, I can't. Guys, I'm thinking this is going to be earrings. That's going to be super cute. Oh, it's a brooch. Ooh, it's a ring. This is one of the horcruxes. That ex that's exciting. Uh, ring enamel pin enamel oh like this part is enamel i guess it smells kind of odd i don't know why that is so cute though by the way i totally need to get me oh it has like that this is why i thought they were earrings because there was like two little thingies um i need to get me the robe i know i don't have the robe but it's because when I, so when I went to the Universal Studios in London, um, I already had a lot of stuff in my luggage from London and then I bought like Hedwig and I bought uh, some shirts and I bought, I, I bought quite a few stuff from the shop too. So I didn't buy a robe. Um, so I was planning to like if I ever do get to go to the Universal Studios, um, like 
uh, theme park would like the section with Harry Potter um, I'm hoping to get it there but honestly I kind of been wanting it for so long maybe I should just buy it online and have it shipped to home um, as of now I guess I could just put this pin like in my lanyard or just like put it in my purse and it'll look real cute I mean on the inside like on the outside I feel like it would look tacky I mean depending what purse I choose I don't know yet I mean maybe I could put it on a shirt but this is super cute and I hope Dumbledore's, I mean Dumbledore's, Voldemort's soul is not actually in here. Let's go for the next one. It's like a little paper. Guys, I have an actual shirt with this on it. I don't know what the cutout is for though. It, so it's a uh, Dementor and then this is the Patronus or Harry Potter's Patronus. I don't know what this is for. Let me keep going. Oh my god, guys. I think these are bookends. Guys, they actually are. That is so cute. How do I open this? Oh, that's cute. So... These guys are, are the ones that fought at the last Battle of Hogwarts. Well, I don't know if they were there at the first. I don't remember. But these are like the statues like at the at the castle. And then McGonagall is super badass and she brings them to life. So that's what these are. And it's super cute because they're bookends. And I've actually been wanting to get some bookends. And these were there. So, I mean, they're not free because I pay for it. But still, like I'm not paying like 500 bucks for bookends. So in the end of the box, this is the last thing uh it's this paper i still don't know what the cutouts are for let's open it how to turn your crate into a patronus stop that is so cute so that's what they're for so you're supposed to fix like put the box in a certain way and then you put the cutouts and then you put a flashlight and it's like they're there that is so cute that is such a good idea um, oh, and then it has, you know, what came in the box. Technically, it's just these, what, five things. But honestly, so I don't remember the exact price. But I want to say it was like $40. $40 is pretty expensive. However, t-shirts usually run you from $20 to like $30. Bucks. So that's already a good price right there. Then you got the little journal, which will probably be like $10 or $12. The pen, same. 10 to 15 dollars um these bookends i don't know because i've never seen these actual book book cases i mean bookends uh but i've seen some bookends for like 20 bucks um and then the enamel pin those would be maybe like five ten dollars so i say for the price it's actually pretty pretty good i'm surprised i'm excited to get the next one i don't know what the theme for the next one is honestly um at first i was like okay i'm gonna wait and then just like uh, not subscribe for the next one because I didn't know what what it was gonna be like But honestly now that I've seen all this super cute stuff I'm excited and I'm totally gonna subscribe for the next one. So stay tuned for the next video Probably within another four months. That's what's so annoying. I want my things now <laughs> Also when I got this box um, Yesterday, <laughs> I mean not like it's been a while um, I was thinking of maybe doing like a Harry Potter collection video. What do you guys think? Um, I've never really done any Harry Potter theme videos in my channel. Um, honestly, I don't know why. However, I, I'm a, such a huge fan. I have so much ish that for Harry Potter, like in the wizarding world. And I would love to do a video like that. It would be kind of lengthy. Uh, but yeah, I would be excited to do so. Um, you guys let me know if you want it. Maybe if you guys don't also do it because I love Harry Potter. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, if you guys want to subscribe to this Loot Crate box, I will go ahead and leave the link down below. And that is it for this video. Please go ahead and share it with your Harry Potter friends, Harry Potter geeks, um, all of us hopefuls that are still waiting for the Hogwarts letter. But yeah, anyways, have a nice day. Bye.